I figured I'd slow down and make this quick video on this intercooler since I get you know quite a few comments and requests asking about it uh, this is going to be another one of our 500 horsepower single backdoor intercoolers using this is the Garrett core I mentioned before it's one of my favorites to weld um, I'm about to put this hot tank together and I thought I'd point out you know I draw and cut all these by hand uh, but something that's really important is when you're putting these together you have this ridge right here that's going to make for a stronger weld and a solid tank. Uh, I haven't actually had to repair one of my own end tanks in probably four or five years uh, and building the tanks is something I had to teach myself you know how to do and that's a lot of that is trial and error you know you get some you, you, you figure out the material you figure out the thickness um, how to fit the tank up you know what does work what doesn't work and you know you don't know that it doesn't work until one breaks so I've got it <laughs> down to where I haven't had one break in quite a while so I stick to how I do them um, on every single one I don't I don't deviate I don't change my metal supplier anymore um, it just is what it is it costs what it costs and it takes as long as it takes but I'm going to go ahead and put this one together get it tacked up um, I'll weld the I'll tack it I'll put some stitches on the inside and then I'll come back and weld the outside up and do the same on the outlet which is going to be a side outlet this is going to be backdoor inlet side outlet intercooler
welded up and drilled out for the inlet and outlet ports. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and weld these on or weld this one on. I'll leave the back door off until I weld it to the core because it's going to put a bunch of heat right here and it's just easier to weld it without that port. And you see this one has a third hole. Um, this customer opted to get the HKS blow off valve flange added to the tank. So I'll weld that flange on. Uh, then get these tacks to the core and get this thing wrapped up. basically it for the intercooler. Um, I'll show y'all some close-ups of it. Uh, thanks for checking it out. Hopefully I answered some questions and showed you uh, some of what you're looking for from previous videos. Um, but again, thanks. I'll show a close-up of this and I'll get out of here. I appreciate it. Ovation, 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 ovation.